I just want to tell you both good luck. We're all counting on you. Hey everybody, how you all doing? This is Con Over coming to you with a, something slightly different today. I say slightly because it really is just slightly different. Um, today is Sim Airport. This is the early access for this game. And indeed, we have ourselves, well, it's it's supremely new. I've, I've seen this come out for a couple months, but at the same time, if you ever want to run your own airport, this is that time for it. Now, let's be fair, this is not what you might expect from your regular Sim games. You can tell down here it looks much more like Prison Architect more than it does necessarily um, a Sim game. But... Regardless, we are going to be doing that, and uh, we're starting off on a very, very, very big map, and we have ourselves just one gate. Uh, we have restrooms on both sides. This is the not starting from scratch. Um, ticketing, baggage claim, we have a female restroom, a couple of male restrooms, blah, blah, blah. And so I guess the first thing we're going to do immediately is we will probably... Hmm... Well, let's get ourselves a very quick... Oh my gosh, what's it called here? Well, baggage carousel for one would be kind of nice. So we're going to quickly set one of those things up. Um, and while we're at it, we're going to also hit play. Let them start to come in already. Um, as well, let's take a quick look at what we can do around here. Um, let's bring in a schedule, first of all, just to see. No, not that. Airline interest. There we go. So this is where the game actually begins to happen. It's interesting to see each of these planes will come on in from a particular kind of flight. What kind of, you know, a number of passengers, etc., etc. And as you get bigger and bigger airports, you get to have a longer and longer runway lengths and more kinds of planes and, and all that kind of good stuff. So we're going to take Embraer 195 and we'll accept that. And let's see what kind of scheduling we can do for it. So make this bigger. And since it's the morning arrival, let's call it a 5 a.m. or 5.15 a.m. Just as good, right? And we're going to also, oops, do not remove. And let's also make this a slightly longer loading time because I don't want to go and screw anything up. And we have a sound issue, so one second. There we go. All right. There we go. Much better. All right. So we can change how much they, how much it costs them. We can change how much it uses that we charge the airlines to, to have that business go on. Well, let's get ourselves a couple things really kind of set up quickly. Like, for example, let's get a um, baggage hub. Or, you know what? Let's do a baggage, a large baggage hub because we will be extending it fairly quickly, I am sure. So let's plop this bad boy down right about here. And because of that, we can build some conveyor belts under underground. That's functional. This will be functional in just a second. There we go. Um, now, I should be able to... No, nope, not going to sign it there. Not, not going to be worried about that. Um, so what things do we want to take care of actually immediately? Well, first things first, we probably should take care of. We should probably shift up all these areas down here because this can lead to a lot of issues with your people. So, let's just actually KO all of these zones. Alright, so uh, baggage claims already been set up. We have, let's get a delivery one up here. Now, oh, large can do more supplies, supply shelves, blah, blah, blah. Alright, cool. There we go, that's there. Um, let's get a garbage above it. Let's not put it too close to all the passengers coming on in, which are not obviously here yet. Uh, drop off. So let's make a nice big drop off area, just like most airlines. And pickups. I wish I could send them farther away, but I kind of have to do this, you know, moderately nicely. So, ka chow. Um, storage as well. So, kind of good stuff in the meantime. Stick that up here. And I'm guessing we should also probably handle something immediately, too. And that is make a baggage depot. Yes. Baggage depot. Is good. Uh, let's plop it down. Let's call it right there. And because we have that, we should probably put also in a line coming the other direction here. I'm sure I'm screwing this up at some point. No, that's actually completely wrong. Eat gats. Cancel that project. Cancel this project as well. Um... One thing to note about this is that these these lines do matter. So headed out, we want to go someplace that's going to be headed in. So collect blue to blue, pink to pink, or purple to purple, whatever you want to call it. So I'm sure I'm doing this wrong already. So somebody out there is probably going to laugh at me for doing it this way. Let's get this down here, though. We're going to have baggage claim come on out and actually cancel a stupid project because that's not right. 
There we go. So now we have guys underneath. Let's also put a hangar up over here. Increase the priority of that bad boy. And what else do we need immediately? Well, really not that much. I don't want to go and put in too much garbage immediately. Um, as you see right now, I guys just trying to make everything kind of bigger. And now I'm thinking about it too. One thing I probably should do is make this area over here much bigger because if it's one thing we hate about... Oof, what's the term I'm looking for? One thing we really hate about... The airport is that security is always so constrained now, isn't it? And immediately we'll probably start trying to make sure we can get security. And now we've got to get... Yeah, to make that a more impressive first, don't we? I'm calling a couple other workers. Um, ooh, how nice. So the staff is over here. Maybe what we'll do in the meantime while we're waiting for this to get set up and this to get set up is maybe we'll put in some kind of like relaxing area. So maybe a bench. Eh, let's not make it too comfortable. I think we'll just make them... Well, it's the airport after all. It would be a two-seater bench or a three-seater. Eh, I'll be kind of nice to people. I'm not going to close them in too, too much. That's their job in the airplanes, right? All right, so that's there. Oh, uh, no ops. Anything spectacular over here? Not necessarily. Metal detectors, large sliding doors. Not going to worry too worried about that. I'll tell you what we will be worried about. Let's make a couple of cues up in here. Um... And there we go. A nice long queue there. And I can start here. So down, over, up, over, down, down, over, over, down. There we go. And as we start to get this area bigger and bigger, we'll be able to make more ticketing desks and the like. Um, that's empty. It's functional. And this still requires one gate to be assigned. And let's also increase the priority. Okay, so it's not assigned to a candidate gate. Now, here's the thing I'm a little bit squiffy about. Ooh, I need to get a storage zone a little bit bigger. There we go. Is that better? There we go. Cool. Um, one thing I to get a little bit better about is that I've literally played like 20 minutes of this game. So we're going to see ourselves having a very, very slow start, I'm sure. And I'm a little bit hazy on a couple of the ideas. So please bear with me. Uh, but we got, okay, so we have this thing right here. Actually, the really cool thing about this is that as the game gets more and more further along, um, like I said, this is in uh, early access right now, so you get to see actually the planes come in, they do the whole thing, their song and dance. Uh, I'm actually kind of excited about it. It's pretty cool. And apparently I have to, it's not going to be ready, I think, in time. Let's speed up a little bit more. So 10 times speed. Ludicrous speed, go! Increase the priority. Make it very important. Bench, bench. Okay, so it requires a secure area. Ah, okay, so we've begun to get this entire area on out. I need a baggage car, don't I? Assign vehicles. Slot. Add. Oh, I'll add a baggage car tomorrow. Speed it up, though. Alright. In the meantime, these guys need to probably pick this on up, too. Assign here. And assign... Can't assign there? Hmm. Well, maybe what we have to do first is... Assign a vehicle. Aha! So that's assigned, and that's assigned. How about utilities now? What do we have to do? I don't need a fuel truck, do I? I don't believe I do, but we'll see in just a second. This area up down here needs to kind of get a little bit more spiffy. And we're going to be losing some money early on, but that's okay. It's going to happen. I think we're almost done with the stuff underneath. No, we're not. Jeez, it's going to take forever. I hate doing that kind of thing early on, but you know what? It might be necessary for the moment. Oh, we're thinking about that. Let's think about a couple ways to kind of spiff up this area. One, I'm thinking about putting in new floors, but maybe I'll wait with that until I actually have a little bit more worthwhile material to look at. How about flight display? This is a good idea. So we can have 
a little bit of information so people are just not going to be wandering around like morons. Alright, so... It's functional. Assign vehicles. Requires upstream hub to support loading baggage. Are we not upstreamed? Uh-huh. Oops. Problem solved, hopefully. That'd be kind of nice. Hurry up, guys. We got a flight coming in in a couple hours. Gotta get this done. And this down here doesn't... I don't like this very much, so... Let's get rid of that. Free. Clear. There we go. That's what we want to do. Great. Cool. So now we actually have a baggage depot. We all have good stuff. And I'm going to start firing some of my staff because I frankly don't need them. Um, reports. Staff info. It cost me $800 to fire somebody? What kind of madness is this? Oh, well. That's okay. So the wall's gone. We have all that kind of nifty stuff also all set. So one thing we're going to do in the meantime as well, since we have all this, we actually have plenty of space here, is let's bring in another AM flight. So a morning is CRJ900. So 75 passengers. Eh, might as well. Okay, let's accept that. Schedule. Now, what do we want to do with this one? Okay, so one thing you have to be really kind of careful about when you're playing this game is that if you do a single gate, well, it is going to uh, need probably about 15 minutes. Our turnaround time. Let's also make, let's just also make the, the boarding time a little bit longer. Um, I'd rather just make sure that we sacrifice a little bit of pay so we can make money later on. In fact, you know, let's get another one in the afternoon. So what do we got for afternoon? Schedule. Where is that going now? So arrow time 4890. Looks like we have more than enough opportunity just to use the uh, noon o'clock and kind of go from there. And we have that nonsense happening again. There we go. So ludicrous speed going. Um, and I was going to wait for a couple of seconds here. Actually, you know what? Now I can start building in my floors. I have $156,000. Um, can I make it more spiffy? Carpet, maybe? Hmm. You know what? Let's make it carpeted over here. Call it visual improvements. And I'm a little bit hesitant about putting it out here. I mean, people are just have such dirty feet. What I can probably do, though... Wow. Oh, never mind. It's 50 per meter square. Hey, it actually, that's movement speed. Cool. I had not realized that. Um... Kind of create a design, perhaps. Maybe we'll do a design over here. It's going to take me a while, guys, but we have plenty of time, as... It does look like we have to wait until... All that uh, first planes are coming on in. So, actually, yeah, we're going to just make it go faster. And now we wait. So, you know, I don't know exactly what I want to do with this airport just yet. Uh, so I'm more than willing to listen to your ideas. But early on, it's going to be a little bit of a slow start for us. I'm thinking that... Um, ooh, I kind of like this color. Very nice. That we'll just kind of take it easy. This first video. Uh, you know, still finding my sea legs and all that. Uh, but that's a rather awesome blue. I actually really like that blue. It, the rug really ties the room together. F and A, man. F and A. Um... Anybody out there who gets that, I'll be very happy. As of right now, just keep thinking of all the air, uh, airplane puns going on throughout my head. Just want you to know, we're all counting on you. I kind of like this. I have to admit, I do enjoy the occasional sandbox. Oh wait, our first people are coming in! Okay, so... Um, we're actually doing a great job right now. I was actually really stupidly concerned about this, but... Cues are functioning awesome. For, uh, frustration is super low. We probably end up making another security area down here just to make it easier. Or at least moving it slightly and shifting this up. In fact, I think after we have people leave in the afternoon, that's exactly what we're going to have happen. Oh my god, you guys are jerks. Go into the queue, you morons. 
Whatever. Whatever. Um. Now we'll get. Let's get back to this. We'll figure out the kinks in a bit. But airline puns, like airplane puns, rather. Um, business might be taken off soon. Um, the fog's getting thicker and Leon's getting larger. I don't know. Definitely one of those movies I first saw as a kid and laughed hysterically. And I watched it a little while ago as an adult and I still laughed hysterically. And to me, that makes a good movie. Almost done with my design. There we go. That's the design right there. Cool. Nice. All right. In the meantime, now people are going to be waiting over here for their plane to come on in. So that would be nice. I don't know if I have to expand the queue up further or what the deal is, but right now people are not standing in line. It's kind of me a little bit annoyed. Um, looks like we're okay in terms of security. So that's nice. And wow, my pasture satisfaction is fantastic. Uh, what's the one that's not being satisfied the most? Oh, environment. We'll get there. Um, hunger, money, platter. We have restrooms all over the place, so I don't have to worry about that either. Um, and frankly, while I'm thinking about it, put tile in there. I don't trust those people. Ooh, stone. Stone, 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 stone. Carpet. Do we have tile? Come on. Wood? No. A lovely shade of grayish blue there. And maybe a pale mauve. There we go. I mean, nice. No idea why there's no stalls. We just have toilets out in the open. Those poor people. Treating them like animals. Um, and I guess what I probably should do is start adding in some more benches and the like. You know, again, be nice to people. Um, even though they really don't deserve it yet. Because they're not paying enough money to use my airport. So do that there. Do that there. And, you know, it actually is really looking kind of nice. Three-seater bench. Let's not go crazy. And a two-seater. We gotta make this nice and symmetrical. It actually does kind of bother me a little bit if I don't have symmetrical stuff. Um, ATM. Ooh. Makes people happy while giving me five bucks a transaction. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is our first plane coming in? There it is. There it is. How awesome is that? So 54 people not standing in line just yet. But that's okay. They'll be doing it soon enough. So cool. First money coming on in. How awesome is that? Uh, we still have expenditures. are still pretty darn high. Um, but that's okay. People are queuing. People are definitely waiting in line. And oh my god, these people are slobs. Um, comfort. Garbage bin. Those are jerks. You don't deserve this. There we go. Put two of them out there. On the off chance, you guys are not going to be complete barbarians about it. Check the time real quick. Okay, we got about 15 minutes in already. I need another janitor. Jeez, you guys are jerks. I can't believe that. Uh, what else can we do? So, let's actually add in somebody for the PM. We probably... Actually, you know what we can do? Another one. Here we go. So, afternoon. A night. Wait, wait. Beechcraft 1900? Oh, wow. So, that is like super, super fit fancy schmancy. Um, it should be pretty easy, actually. Let's do that. And we'll add into the schedule. There we go. Cool. All right. Lovely. So now we have four people coming on, four uh, planes coming on in already, which means we actually, even before the next ones are even out the door and flying away, I think it was the baggage car right there. Um, we are going to have the next plane coming in soonish. Our schedule of departure is 7:30. Jeez, that probably gave me. You know what? Let's let's uh pulling away super early. Wow. Hey, dude, I you know what? I might be wrong, but I think we had that like pegged down. Look at that. That was awesome. Let's see if we can't go and make this a little more closely packed. I'd love to get more, honestly, I'd love to get more material in here so that way people can just get make me more money. But knowing that, people will probably screw with me and make me just be upset. Um, garbage bins out here as well. I can't believe you people are just that much of slobs. 
Actually, I kind of can, um, but I really wish I didn't think that way. Objects. Um, back to floors. So I don't want to continue this. Maybe a nice little black in the meantime? I wonder how that will look. Hmm. Reminds me of all the times I spent in the airport. Hmm. Dark days. But a lot of fun. I don't know. Anybody out there been on an airplane recently, please let me know how airports have felt. It's been... Actually, about a month. I was away, as you guys know, for my birthday. Got to be in an airport for that. Oddly exhilarating, you know? Until we had our flight get canceled on the way back, and that was just a lot less fun. So going through this day number two, we actually already have a fairly thriving airplane economy. Already. It's not perfect, mind you, but, you know, it's not too bad. And I think adding the design makes me a little bit happier than just having straight everything be blue. I am kind of wondering, though, if people are using my ATM, or if they're just abusing my kindness, and sitting without paying for anything. I'm also wondering if I'm spending more money by putting this in one block at a time. And then I realize, for the most part, I don't really care. Again, 120. You're set to go, right? Should be able to, anyway. Supply truck, he's pretty good. Um, anybody coming in appropriately, or no? The 5 a.m.'s gone. The 5 a.m.'s been gone for a long time. Huh. There we go. Starting to color in. Now, the question is, what do I put in the meantime in there? Or tools? What's this? Uh, windows. Eh, we're not going to go and... Um be that nice to them. So how many? 40 people standing in line. So yeah, I'm gonna kill this one. Boarding starts already. Yeah. If anybody is late for this plane, they deserve to miss it. Yeah, 36 already. Yeah, dude, we're, we're crazy good. Alright, so you know what? In the future, this is gonna get a little bit fewer time as well. So there you go. So that one leaves us 7. The next one gets here at 7.30. 15 minutes. Plenty of time. Actually, you know, let's make sure that boarding time takes two hours. And that dumb sound thing's happening again. All right, guys, we're going to go through the end of day two, and then we're probably going to call it a brief period of waiting. Probably the end of this particular video for that time. It's raining now, so one thing to think about um, while you run your own airport is that there actually is an effect of weather on your people, so it can delay flights, it can make them super, super bad. It's 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 worth knowing. It's worth understanding, too. Do I have an ATM? No, I have garbage cans, because people are slobs. Uh, where did I put the ATM? I didn't. Let's change that. Comfort. Flight info display. Let's set this up. There we go. It's functional already. Someone please tell me making money off that, because that'd be great. Just look at reports. How about that? So secure, no sectors, no. How lovely is that? Cool. So this has a lot more functionality in the future, as you can see. It'll be pretty darn sweet there. Info. Feel those info right there. Environmental heat map. Um, not a lot to worry about there. And secure areas. So security. Awesome, right? And now we have this area over here that doesn't have a whole lot of security because they're already through security. Um, I'm assuming as we move further and further along, I will have to extend down here. It makes security rather beefy. Uh, but for the moment, we don't have to worry too much, I don't think. How many people have checked in? I don't know. We'll figure that out soon enough. Actually, let's continue running this at double speed. And 46. So... Again, I kind of wonder, how many people have checked in for this flight already? Gotta be a fair few. Start queuing, you fool. Start queuing. Ooh, we have first class? Nice. Alright. 18, 20... It departs in two hours, and we almost already have... Yeah, dude, we're, we're killing this. We are killing it, son. Um, staff expense is still insanely high. Um, so we probably have to pick up another flight or two. Take a look at the schedule real quick. Might be able to fit in one more. Embraer 195. 90 passengers. Yeah, we can accept that. 
All right, so we should get, get that in. Yikes, okay, maybe not. Sorry about all the clicking of this bell tones there, but at the same time, all right, so this hovers over into the evening, so that should be fine. Um, this right now kind of looks like it's a chessboard or something, so maybe, maybe it wasn't as good to go and go for that whole hash pattern. Maybe we need right now something to kind of bring the entire area together. Maybe this will do. Uh, that's a four times speed. Um, in any case, if you guys want to see more of this game, um, it's my hope to put this, at least update videos out here and there. And if nothing else, I might just post another one or two of these videos just to see as the game moves further and further along, if it gets more difficult or if it's just kind of your standard sandbox. Um, I do know there are people already who have put things out there like Berlin's Tiefel Airport, which is pretty damn impressive, if I can say so myself. Um, but, you know, I have something a little bit different. I don't just want to run just straight strategy games for you guys. Every now and again, I want to do something goofy. A little bit, you know, not fun-ish per se, but, you know, different. I don't like how this blue is actually looking against the black, so I might end up replacing the black as we go further and further along. And I don't know which of these squares I have now selected. No! Cancel project. There we go. Phew. Just in time, I'm sure. So 406. Wait, where's it actually getting here? Oh, wow. Actually, we're pretty much done here. So now that I think the rest of this time is just going to be me finishing up the cross hatching of this floor. And that'll be pretty much it for today, guys. Um, so thank you guys so much for tuning in. It's been about a 20, 25 minute video. Um, and I think when we come back tomorrow, we're going to try to actually what we should do. Start exploring things like CFOs. And let's get a COO in here as well. So finance at that point, advanced reports, bank loans, lower taxes, and improved profit margins. We definitely need that. Pricing, that could be kind of fun. Um... What I may end up doing is actually running this for a couple of days so we can just get more cash coming on in. I don't want you guys to sit around waiting for me to go and be able to add things in to our lovely estate. So thank you guys so much for tuning in. This has been Con Ulrich showing you Sim Airport. Uh, if you like what you see, please hit, hit that like, com uh, like button below. Subscribe, comment. Want to give me feedback, let me know. If there's a game out there you want me to check out, uh, email me at conorgaming at gmail.com. Uh, but that'll be it for me today, folks. Thank you so much, and I'll see you all soon. Take it easy.